James is the best basketball player in the world. Ten All-Star appearances, four MVP awards, and two NBA titles. He makes one trip to Utah a year. Tonight was your chance to see him in person. The Heat have lost their last two trips to Salt Lake City. LeBron making his presence felt early, knocking down the three. But the Jazz were on fire in the first quarter. Trey Burke. He hits a three to give the Jazz a five-point lead. 21 first-half points in Dallas Friday for Marvin Williams. Another hot start for Marvin. He hits a three. Second quarter. The Jazz take a double-digit lead. Jeremy Evans <laughs> finds a loose ball and finishes with authority. How about Alec Burks? Continues his terrific play. He had 12 points off the bench. Making tough shots like that around the rim. Jazz led by 12, but Miami makes a run to close the gap. LeBron doing what he does best. And then Mario Chalmers in the corner, knocks down a three, and Miami takes a one-point lead, but the half isn't over. Marvin is still red hot. He gives the Jazz a 52-50 lead at the half. The Heat would take back the lead in the third quarter, but the Jazz would respond every time. Three straight buckets by Ennis Kander. Five minutes left in the game. Chalmers to Wade. He'd get within four, but the Jazz answer their run. Marvin Williams hits one moments later. Richard Jefferson's going to chase down the loose ball. Marvin off balance. Back-to-back -back threes. He led the Jazz again tonight with 23. Miami keeps coming. Ray Allen, we've seen that before. Here within two. Jazz need a big shot. Who else but Trey Burke? Five to shoot. Down to three. Jumper away. Got it! Big shot! The Jazz hold LeBron to a season-low 13 points and send a lot of bandwagon Heat fans home with a loss.